What's up everybody, Lauren Jabari here with Pixel Eyes and this is How to Bet Better, where we go over important topics to know when betting on sports. Next up in this series, the money line, which may just be the easiest term to explain in the entire series. Simply put, you bet on a team to win. Of course, we'll still break it down with a couple of examples, starting off with the Super Bowl. The Eagles were minus 115 on the money line heading into the game, and the Chiefs were plus 105. This means that if you bet on the Eagles' money line at minus 115, you would just need them to win the game for your ticket to cash. And the minus 115 means that for every $115 you bet, you'd win $100 in profit. Now on the other side, if you correctly thought the Chiefs were gonna win the game, betting them on the money line at odds of plus 105 meant that a $100 bet returned $105 in profits. So if there's a minus sign in front, it's how much you'd have to wager to win $100. But if there's a plus sign, it's how much a $100 bet would win. Once you get the hang of all of that, the beauty of it, it's the same for all sports, not just football. Each team will have a price set for their money line to win the game, which will vary depending on who's playing in the game and how big of a favorite or underdog that team is. So hopefully that helps you get started because understanding the money line and the odds and prices attached to it is a key part of the basics of sports betting. For more insights and advice every day, be sure to download the PixWise app as you learn how to bet better.